Oh my god, look over there. There's some ice cream. Holy shit, that's so much. It looks so good. Oh, here's a spoon. It's perfect. It's perfect. It's kind of small, but you know, I don't, I don't even know whose who's, uh, ice cream this is. Wait a minute. This is some kind of joke? Do that. Only a spoonful, huh? Yeah. Give me that fucking ice cream. Come here, come here. Give me the... the. Oh, I got it on my foot. Fuck it. Hello, and welcome to my giant spoon review. If you're wondering why my voice sounds a little muffled, that's because I'm wearing a mask and a beanie to cover my head and face because this giant metal thing is very reflective and I'm not looking to dox my face right now. But uh, if you want to know what mask it is, just pretend I walked off the set off Mr. Robot or something. No one cared who I was until I stopped playing Fall Guys. So yeah, you know that vine with King Bach? You know, the one where he wants a spoonful of ice cream, he pulls out the comedically large spoon? You know, I thought to myself, I want a comedically large spoon, let me see if I can buy one. And turns out it's very hard to find that same exact one he had. My best guess is that that was actually a custom-made uh, eccentric gift for a million-dollar L.A. mansion, well, millionaire L.A. mansion or some shit. Uh, because that thing, I, I found people who were selling like custom giant utensils for like a few grand, you know. But I don't have that. So, it, but I actually managed to find this. This is the Arc LS one two one forty eight inch giant spoon. Unfortunately, I could only find it on uh, Mr. Bezos. Uh, Hell site Amazon, but hey, 37 bones, fuck it, you know? And uh, yeah, let's take a closer look. As you can see here on the handle, it says USA, you know, patriotic pride, but not even patriotic pride could uh, beat the manufacturing prices of China because <laughs> this thing is made in fucking China. And uh, yeah, supposedly it's four feet long, but I want to make sure I didn't get fucking focus camera. I want to make sure I didn't get ripped off, so let's start by uh, taking some measurements. All right, I hope I don't snap my fingers with this thing. It's very precarious. Uh-huh. Looks like... Oh shit, it's sliding, it's sliding. Motherfucker. Ah! Well, I found out that you can just hold down the tape with a button on the front. It's literally right there. But it looks like we did not get ripped off. That thing's just shy of 4 feet, or 48 inches. If you're metric, that's 122 centimeters. So, uh, yeah. And the, as for the big spoon, that looks like about, uh... Uh... Motherfucker, stop twisting. Eight inches, or uh, twenty centimeters, or like a fifth of a, of a meter. Yeah. All right, but how much can the spoon hold? Ah, shit! I I thought that thought that felt the. Hang on, hang on. It's still not full. What the fuck? All right, I'm not gonna try to tiptoe back to my fridge again, but it holds at least two cans of Barks, which is, uh, I don't know how many ounces is that shit, 12 or something? I'm not gonna go look for it, but yeah, it, it holds, it holds a lot. Let's see if I can drink from it. This is a stupid idea, never do this. <sighs> All right, well, I'm refreshed, um... And yeah, I, I know I know some people are gonna flame me for getting for getting the diet, but listen, man, listen. Let me show you. The, let me show you the regular. Look, man, I know all soda is bad for you, and regular Coke is still bad and all shit. But 150 percent on like normal, like, get the fuck out of here. I'd rather I'd rather roll the dice with the, the aspartame. Listen, all right, I I just rather do that. This shit's not sponsored, by the way. This is just my new fixation of the month. Just fucking. Root beer, I guess. Alright, as you can see here, I got every spoon in my house. And now we're gonna see how many spoons can you fit inside this spoon. One, two, three, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, shit. Oh, no, I spilled them. Motherfucker. Seventeen. Eighteen. Thirty. Thirty-one. Thirty-two. Thirty-three. I ran out of spoons. It holds at least 33 spoons. That's a pretty good deal for $37. Okay, scenario time. Picture this. It's 7.35 on a weekday at Coney Island. You're taking the end train back home. Suddenly, a weird man jumps out and goes oogly googly googly. I'm gonna take your fucking eyelids. 
this has enacted a self-defense situation. And all you have in your inventory is a comedically large spoon. Can this protect you? Ouch. Okay, not bad. I mean, it's, it's, it's hollow, but, you know... All right, let's check its slicing abilities. Let's say you're the freaking Coney Island that wants to take somebody's eyelids. Bing bong. Whoa, look at that. Sliced it right in half. Clean. I'm telling you, man, this thing, this thing is more than a purchase. It's an investment on your life. <coughs> you can buy it anywhere on but Amazon, though. That'd be great, though. But, you know, what can you do? <coughs> At this point, I think we've tested everything, and this thing looks really good. But, you know, there's only one thing left to ask. Can you use this thing as a giant cereal bowl? So we got here is um, peanut butter Captain Crunch. I haven't had that since high school, but I know it fucking slaps. And then lactate. It's the only thing in the house because you know if my mom drinks normal milk, she's gonna get the ooey ouchies. So uh, yeah, let's 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 assemble the bowl. Ah shit! I'm wearing a mask. Oh, it's so good. Mmm. 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 Mm. Oh shit, I dropped some. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can totally use this thing as a giant bowl of cereal. What the fuck am I doing? Alright, I hope you enjoyed that review of a giant spoon. Um, this, if you watched my old second channel, Jinjo Gaming, you definitely probably enjoyed this video because it's more like that. If you didn't, you know, if it's not your speed, that's totally fine. But, uh, yeah, I just really wanted to do this because I thought, I thought it'd be fun. And yeah. Uh, I'm gonna finish that bowl of cereal and get back to learning code and shit, and, uh, yeah, uh, I was gonna say when I'd upload next, but, you know, that'd be unhealthy. I don't want to do no upload schedule, right? <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, I hope you also enjoyed the other video with, uh, Comvic Chris from the We Made a Pizza video going to the, going to the city and meeting me up, meeting up with me, you know? But, uh, anyways, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go now. Uh, yeah, you know, 3D in the web and shit. Okay, see you around, bye.